A topic that really hits home for so many people. We're talking about housing. If you didn't know, you may want to listen to this. There is a housing crunch and some people have called it really a crisis around here. Bottom line, there is a need for more affordable housing. Hundreds took over the Buffalo Convention Center for the Upstate New York Affordable Housing Conference. The goal is to find solutions to the state's housing crisis. The housing stock is deteriorating and new build costs are high. Because there's so much couch surfing nowadays, affordable housing, you would think there would be enough, but there isn't. There is a critical shortage, not just in New York State nationally, and New York has led the country in some of our innovative ways to finance and build housing. We're still not able to build enough housing. People are doubling up. Couch surfing is a problem. People are living out of their cars. People are paying way too much of their income, half their income, in rent. So what does affordable housing look like in the future? There are plans to build up streets and fill in empty lots. What we want to see is pick a street that is otherwise strong and has a couple missing teeth where we can put in this new home ownership opportunity to help um, help secure the whole street. And also, we sort of see this as uh, preventing gentrification. All day, there were sessions. There was discussion about government's role in creating housing and the obstacles they've encountered. All the private developers come to us and say, as Kate mentioned, look at this big empty street and uh, I can build all of the houses next one. Well, there's no neighbors. And when there's no neighbors, there's typically no amenities. There's no mass transit. Mahaffey says location and access is critical for residents. There are other priorities. That's what People Inc. is already doing. So we have two projects under construction right now. One in East Buffalo uh, that is a co-partner project with Mount Olive Baptist Church. And that will be 65 units of senior housing on the east side of Buffalo. So we're thrilled about that. That will open next fall. And then we also have 93 units of affordable housing in the village of Williamsville on Evans that's under construction. And she says there is a waiting list.